Many cinemas have been forced to shut their doors during the pandemic and one decision could spell the final act. Streaming services will premiere blockbusters online as well as at the theatre and some fear theatres simply won't be able to compete. Since 1894, Australia's cinema industry has thrived. But the pandemic forced moviegoers to stay home, turning our cinemas dark. It was an amazing start to the year and then obviously COVID hit. Streaming services are taking advantage. Disney Plus will drop 100 titles over the next few years online, including 15 films. Warner Brothers will release all its movies in cinemas and on its streaming service HBO Max in the US. Warner Brothers made a shock announcement last week that caught most of the industry, including their own filmmakers, by surprise. It's not clear how this will work in Australia just yet, but Warner Media does have a deal with Foxtel and its streaming service Binge. When the big screen is bypassed or a huge title is available to watch from your couch at the same time as cinemas, many of us will choose to stay home. But the owners of Ritz Cinema in Randwick, which reopened in July, are confident the shared experience of a trip to the movies will prevail. It's an amazing crop of Australian films that are um, finding a lot of screens. Including here at the Ritz, where Aussie actor Eric Banner will be on hand next week to launch his new Australian film to a live audience. And experienced cinema lovers say can't be replicated online. Once we can congregate again in larger numbers here in Australia and globally, time will tell if our love affair with movies on the big screen grows deeper. Samantha Brett, 7 News.